Hey guys, it's a total disaster. My dad sent me some kind of spaced out driver this morning. <sighs> to begin with, he didn't allow me to wear my makeup in the car. And then he sharply slammed on the brakes, so my toner spilled all over the car interior. Can you imagine that? My toner doesn't cost 200 or 300 bucks, you know. Ugh. You may ask, what happened next? Of course I wanted to get out of the car right away. He started yelling so loud. I don't know, maybe he felt sorry for my toner too. Who knows, whatever. So? <laughs> New love? What the heck? Um, okay guys, I finally made it to campus. I've not been here for so long. Two weeks. I can't wait to see everyone. All right, I'm gonna wrap up the streaming. Thank you all. Mwah. Bye, sisters. Why isn't anyone coming to meet me? Am I the first to arrive? What a shame. <laughs> All right, see ya. <gasps> My girls, I knew there was someone on campus. I'm gonna go get changed and quickly join you. Emma, I'm coming. Hi there, my lovelies. What? Oh my God. I was just mad when I walked into the room and saw Mary. I just wanted to wipe her out. You cannot imagine the situation we had over the vacations. It's... it's just a mess. Well, for now, I'm not ready to tell you the details. But you should know that we're arch nemeses from now on. Mary, if you're watching this, you should know that I hate you. You? Uh, uh, what the heck are you doing in this room? Well, my dear... Uh, don't call me like that. What are you doing in my room? Actually, I live here and so do Emma and Chloe. That's why you have exactly three seconds to make yourself disappear out of here. Otherwise, I'll wipe out the face of the earth. Do you get me? Get out of here. First, there's no need to yell. And second, I live here too from now on. I received the report and my room number is 22. That doesn't make sense. Haven't you seen the lists on the website? Look carefully. They say clearly who lives with whom. Are you trying to say you really live here? Hey, is anyone home? Oh, finally, my real friends are here. Now you're totally screwed. Chloe and Tyler are there, and Chloe's totally gonna get you absolutely whacked. Hey, is anyone home? <gasps> Tyler! You cannot even imagine how glad I am to see you. Well, hi, Brittany. <sighs> There's a new toad move into our room. And now it's gonna live with us instead of Chloe. Can you believe it? There's only one toad here. Hey, Tyler. <laughs> hey, girls, hey. Tyler, hold me, because I'm gonna lose it. <sighs> You're just lucky, though, because Tyler was holding me back. <laughs> what a pathetic loser you are. <laughs> By the way, Tyler, where's Chloe? Yeah, where's my bestie, Chloe? In your dreams. Girls, I I need to go unpack my stuff. I'd rather go. Hashtag of the day, Mary, you're a toad. Emma, did I tell you I love you? You did 70 times for the last hour. 71. I love you. Hold on, Alex. You remember our deal, don't you? I do. Uh-huh. Which one? We won't tell anyone we're together. 
Atta boy. Did I deserve a kiss? Uh, no. We're already on campus, so no more kisses. You won't contain it yourself. Who, me? Don't make me laugh. All right, we're going in. Emma! What? Come on, Alex. All right, let's go. Okay, there. One, two, three. Come on, Emma. I can't do that, Alex. I feel embarrassed. All right, guys, you're gonna lose your breath. Yes, we date. Yeah. However, Emma decided that we should hide it from everyone. Right? Well, for now, yeah. And then we'll see. I'm blessed to have such a beautiful girl. <gasps> Alex, enough. Turn off the camera. Turn off the camera. All right, that goes there. And this one I'll put away later. <gasps> Brittany! Emma! Yeah, we gotta have a good day. All my people down the ride, turning up into the sky, that's fast. Yeah, I'm about to break it down, babe. I get anything you want, really, just to get a smile real tough. Boy, I get it for my people. Reunion of BFFs. What's up, bro? Hey! Okay, guys, I'm gonna tell you the news right away, and you're gonna lose your minds. Are you ready to be shocked? Emma, did you know Mary's gonna share our room? Oh, well, yeah. What do you mean, yeah? Is that what you're sweating about? No, I'm not gonna put up with it. You know what happened during the school break? Bro, where's Chloe? Yeah, where's Chloe? Gosh, guys, I've got noodles boiling in the kitchen. I gotta go. He's strange. You bet. She just doesn't know who she's messing with. <gasps> Twixes! Brittany! Hey! And you! You look the same! Why do you have such a big travel bag? Did you pack it with gifts? Uh, uh. Wait a minute. Is that Leopold in there? Nope! Nope! I can clearly hear Leopold's voice. Oh, come on, Bree. You just missed him so much that you could hear his voice. Maybe. I'm out of here for a showdown. Holy balls! Maybe it's time to let him out, huh? Okay. Are you out of your freaking minds? Yes! I hate you! I think it was fun. You lost your glasses! Well, I'm not mad at them at all. They're Twixes. They always play tricks like that. Honestly, we're friends, and besties always make jokes like that. No offense taken at all. We're not shooting? Man, to be honest, it was very offensive. It was upsetting. <sighs> I'm not saying a word just because I'm working out a plan to destroy you. <laughs> well, good luck with that. Hi to campus part A students. Here is the most popular... <laughs> Oops, sorry, I must have interjaculated you, didn't I? Here is the most popular Part A campus student, Brie. Write in the comments if you live with the person that you hate. Hi to Part A campus students. Write below in comments what would you do if your best friend became your enemy? Well, we have the tying run, but that's just the beginning. I'm off to get done with some bigger things. This is a total mess up. Where's Chloe? I need her right away. I don't have a clue. What do you mean you have no clue? Don't you know where your girlfriend is? Nope. Have you gone mental? Give me my phone back. I won't give it back. Give me the phone. Give me the well, phone back now. Where's Chloe? Where's Chloe? I said I don't know. Oh, I'm so sick of y'all. I, I don't know what to say. There's not much I can say. They've been asking all day long about Chloe and how Chloe is. I'm so sick. I'm so sick of them. I've just made up my mind to get them together. 
I hope. I hope they stop asking me about Chloe. And you guys, don't ask me to, please. Jeez, guys, I miss you all so bad. Yeah, yeah and me, yeah, I missed everyone, I missed everyone <laughs> so much. Uh. What's new? Got anything to share? I have. Well then, would you like to share with us while you gathered us here anyway? Perhaps Tyler has something to tell us. You can't be serious! Anyway, during the last three hours we were here on campus, everyone came up to me and probably asked me a thousand times about Chloe. Where was Chloe? How was Chloe? Why I came here without Chloe and when Chloe would be here. Yeah, indeed. Everyone wonders where she is and I, for instance, miss her so much. Chloe will be here soon. No worries. Yay! Awesome, the campus will be whole I again. I got it. They must have gotten into a fight again. Oh, you shut up. Hey, Tyler, chill out. What's wrong with you? Don't get mad, bro. You've changed over the school break. Yeah, bro, come on. Why are you so negative? You out of flight. You'll make it up. Yeah, keep the dogs at bay. We didn't argue. We <sighs> broke up. Tyler and Chloe are not a couple anymore. And will never be. Period. Thank you all for your time and have a great semester. That isn't you. Cause I was on my own when you were by my side. So there's no difference now, except there's nothing to hide. Hi, it's a part A campus students. It's just the first day, but something important just happened. Let me go. Did you know Tyler and Chloe have just broken up? Holy cats. Well, you guys, write hashtag shop content in your comments if you're also shocked by what's going on here. How so? Maybe you can explain. Hey! Is anyone here on campus? Hello everyone, this is a part A school. Anything can happen here. But we don't really like to study. The campus would be boring without different pranks and jokes. You see, it's really fun. Sometimes we're friends and even have a lot of fun. Until Mrs. Cooper, our headmistress, comes along and yells at us again for skipping her classes. She's strict. It is better to not make her angry. But sometimes while no one is watching, Miss Skipper also likes to break the rules. All right, enough talking about the school. Meet Brittany, the most popular girl in school. She loves pink, everyone knows her on Instagram. She can't live without social media and of course without money. She's also the news presenter on our campus. She's a really cool girl who's dating Martin, our crush. Well, I mean, they did it before he dumped her. Now, Martin is with Emma. And they have true love. This is Martin. He knows everything about sports. Thanks to his perseverance, our campus will be the first in sports competitions. He's interested in football, boxing, and anime. <laughs> Sometimes he can stay up all night and watch only anime. He doesn't like studying very much. He likes to watch how Emma learns. He is a true romantic who believes in great love. Emma, our excellent student. She learned all the topics before we even entered the Part A campus. Such smart girls are still to be found. We're proud to have her in our school. But when someone else hangs on the leaderboard, Emma gets angry. And she immediately runs to her snails, whose names are Brittany and Clementine. She says they calm her down. One day, someone wrote that Emma was hideous. Therefore, our Emma decided that this image suits her well. In fact, she's perfect in everything, except for one thing. Relationships. Martin is her first boyfriend ever. So sometimes she behaves weird, but very cute. 
and this is Max and Thomas. They're twins. They're still often confused. I'm Max. I'm Thomas. They're pros in their business. They are amazing at basketball. Max dreams of being a captain and being the coolest in everything. He is in love with Brittany, but as you can see, Brittany is not a very simple girl. So he doesn't understand whether it's worth trying to be with her. By the way, this is Thomas, who misses Mary very much. She was recently expelled, and he's the only person who misses her. Because everyone else just dreamed of her leaving the campus. Remember, I said that Emma is very smart? So Emma is smart. But if you want to see a real genius, then meet Leo. Actually, he calls himself a genius. He loves to read books. Read a lot. Really read a lot. Nobody on campus likes him. What's the reason? He's Miss Cooper's son. I guess it's obvious. And this is Tyler. He's a freaking talented guy. But sometimes he's really funny. It's even cool. He dreams of opening his own studio. His songs will soon be heard by the whole world. He loves playing video games. He's the best at it. Tyler is the captain of the basketball team. I can watch him play forever. Oh, by the way, it's me, Chloe. I'm his girlfriend, who will always support him in everything. Sometimes they fight, but our love is hard to destroy. A lot has happened in the last two months. He made a tattoo for me. Dedicated songs to me. He even taught me how to play video games. And we're pretty good at that. Next to him, I was the happiest girl on the planet. But... He doesn't remember all that. Because... Two days ago, he... Lost his memory. And today, he will come to the campus for the first time. Also, today is my birthday. Didn't she like our surprise? No way, genius. How did you know that? But that's not right. We were preparing a lot and she just left. She's really worried about Tyler. He's coming today. Maybe he'll see us and remember everything. Guys, we need to support Chloe. We're all friendly on the campus. Well, yeah, we're friendly because Mary left. She left because of you. Never mind him. He'll be sad for a day and then he'll thank us that Mary's no longer studying here. Okay. Go decorate the kitchen so the decorations aren't wasted and we'll go talk to Chloe. Okay. Take this. Wait. Guys, write in the comments, Chloe, happy birthday. I think she'll be very happy. Alright, let's go. Yeah, go. Chloe, what are you doing? Washing off my makeup. But it's your birthday. We thought you were doing makeup. Listen, I'll decide whether to do my makeup or not. And anyway, forget about my birthday. But why? Yeah, we were getting ready. We thought it would be the party of the year. 
What party? If my boyfriend doesn't remember neither me nor our love, just nothing. Quiet, quiet. Calm down. Wait, I'm sure Tyler will come see you and immediately remember everything. You just have to look good. Do you really think so? Of course. <laughs> well, you know, you better put on your makeup because even I don't recognize you without it. Damn, Brittany. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm just kidding. Look, you're right. I have to look good when he arrives. We'll help you with it. Guys, write in the comment for Chloe to smile more and stay beautiful. Write in the comments that Chloe is the most beautiful. Do you really think so? Of yes. course! Looks like because of Chloe's birthday, we canceled the basketball competition? Actually, you canceled them because your team captain lost his memory. Yeah, it's not nice to leave for competitions like this. Especially without a captain. Well, yeah, but maybe we can find a new captain? Who, me? I don't need it. Maybe. Okay, guys, Tyler will be back and everything will be settled. Let's get everything ready for the birthday, otherwise the girls will kill us. Yeah, you're right. I understand. Thank you, doctor. I got it. Tyler needs peace, good vibes, and no stress. Miss Cooper, may I come in? Yes, Leo, please. You haven't called me son for a long time. What? Leo, you yourself asked me to call you by your first name at school. It just seems to me that you don't love me. Why do you think so? Of course I love you. I love you very much too. Right. Speak. What do you want from me? Why do you think I want something? Can I tell my mom that I love her for no reason? Of course you can. Although, no. Tell me the truth. Listen. Go ahead. I want to ask a little question. I understand that everyone is worried about Tyler. And it's Chloe's birthday. Speak faster. Who will be the head man? Mary is gone. Headman. Right. I completely forgot. Now we don't have a headman. Great. Then I'll be the head boy. Leo, we also have Emma. She is very responsible too. Let's say you'll be the head boy only if Emma agrees. I disagree. That's what I thought. I should be head girl. Because I've been on campus for a long time and you, Leo, can't be a head boy. Emma, I'll remind you that I actually was the headmaster. And that's why there was total chaos in this school. <laughs> I came up with such an idea. Um, guys, I think you'll like it. Like this video so I know exactly for sure that everyone loves this idea, okay? Martin, did he call you? Oh, Chloe, you look much better. Thanks. It's all thanks to the girls. But to be honest, I don't care about that. I wish Tyler would come soon. Don't worry, he'll be here soon. Chloe, Tyler is here. Now? Yeah, let's go. Everything will be okay, Chloe. Come on, go. Tyler, we're so glad that you're with us. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, Emma. And you? I'm Max. I'm Thomas. They're newbies. You probably don't remember me either. I'm Leo, the genius. Hey guys, stop bothering Tyler. How are you? Fine? Tyler, hello. Hi, Chloe. Do you remember me? Of course I do. We studied together. You have a boyfriend. You see, he remembers. His name is Antua? Tyler, do you remember Chloe's boyfriend, Antua? Bro, don't you remember anything else? For example, that today is Chloe's... Guys, actually, what should I remember? It's our first day on campus. We need to get to know each other better. Okay, I'll go to my room. Does that mean... Tyler forgot everything from his first day on campus? No, it's impossible. He'll definitely remember everything. I... I know he will remember everything. Poor Chloe. Yeah. Looks like he doesn't remember, and doesn't know you at all. 
Looks like he doesn't remember he's team captain. <sighs> okay, guys, let's go. You're sleeping on the second floor, just a reminder. No problems. Listen, bro. Wait. Of course, I understand that we may have been friends before, but now it's kind of inappropriate. Good? Inappropriate what? I mean, hey bro, what's up bro? Let's just chill, you know? Oh, you remember your phrases! Of course I do, that's my thing. And also, I'm freaking hungry. Yeah, getting to know you more and more, bro. I mean, Tyler. Great. The lesson will start soon. I'm gonna go eat something. Okay. So everything starts again? I need to learn all of his phrases, relax and chill. Okay, I'll deal with it. So guys, how was Tyler? Well, like this. Hi right, once again. Chloe, can I borrow your pen? Thanks. Mrs. Cooper, sorry for being late. This is the last time we filmed the news for school. Okay, take your seat. Uh, why are you here? I want to sit with the most beautiful girl on campus. Sorry for being late. And you, Martin, get an F. I wonder if Tyler forgot all of the topics. Shouldn't he be transferred to another class? Based on his grades, he didn't learn anything other than his rap. Tyler, do you remember that? Of course I do, yo. I'm the best rapper in the world. Ugh, pity you don't know you don't have your studio. What? <laughs> Never mind. Miss Cooper, may I make an important announcement? Yes, of course. Mary left, and we have a new head girl. Emma. Um... Thanks. Being a head man is so lame. Actually, you were a head boy too. Really? Well, yeah, you probably just forgot. But that's not all. Emma is a head girl, but now we have a new campus rule. What? Now we have two headmen, Leo and Emma. Hurrah! It's cool being a head man, right, Emma? Okay, silence. Let's start our lesson. Happy birthday, Happy birthday to, to you! Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to, to you! you. Yeah! Woo. In honor of this holiday, I am canceling all lessons today. Awesome! Yeah. Whose birthday is it? What's wrong with her? Anyway, whose birthday is it? Thomas, you wanted to talk? I'm not Thomas, I'm Max. Sorry, I'm just confusing you, you know? It's the first day I see you. Mm-hmm. By the way, bro, if you're into rap right now, don't you care about the basketball team? First of all, I'm not your bro. Why do you ask? Actually, I'm the captain. You? Uh-huh. Who else? You? That's cool. You're captain. Yeah, so you don't mind? Of course. Why should I mind? Moreover, I like Virtual World more. How's that? Well, games, kind of Counter-Strike, Fortnite, you know. Yeah, sure. Okay, I'll go practice. Good, sure, I got it. Oh, hey, Brittany. You saw me like five minutes ago in class, or did you forget? I didn't forget anything. By the way, what are your plans for tonight? What about Chloe? What if she hears us? Who cares about Chloe? I'm only interested in you. Listen, it's better that no one sees us together. She's strange, but beautiful. Martin, what does Brittany like? Tyler, I found this package under my bed. What is it? Written that it's for Chloe. Wait. 
What? Guys, please subscribe to our channel right now so I can tell you what's inside. Subscribed? I know, you bought a present for Chloe. No, apparently you made it for her. Before you lost her memory. Were we good friends? I would say even very good. You know... Go give it to her now, she has a birthday. Thanks. Welcome. Bro. Guys, thanks a lot for all the congratulations. I read all your comments. I'm very happy. May I? Yeah, sure. Come in. This is for you. Happy birthday. Did you remember it's my birthday? Actually, the guys told me. Uh, what's inside? I don't know. Martin said I made this before I lost my memory. That's so cute. I think we were good friends. Tyler, you see, we weren't just friends. I got you, but I gotta go. I got a lot to do. It's my first day on campus, you know. He's been studying here for two months now, and it's like his first day. He has no feelings for me at all. That these books will be ordered by color. No, logically they should stand on the content. I'm telling you like a head boy. I do know, and I tell you as head girls that these books will stand here. No, here. Give it back. I'll decide what's best. No, you can't decide. I'm a head boy too. No way. These books will stand here, period. Give me no, the books. No, no, no. Guys, can I borrow this book? No, no back, back off. off. Why are you screaming? You could calmly say no. That's all, nerd. I'll finish you. <laughs> is that what Four Eyes is telling me? That I'll finish you too? Guys, thanks a lot for watching. Put like, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget about the bell. Also, subscribe to our TikTok and Instagram accounts. And be the first to see our next episode. Write in the comments, what color was the package that I gave to... to... Chloe? Chloe. Write to us. Guys, today we choose from the most liked comment. Today it's from Brittany fans. It says, I and your entire fan community support you. Guys, I'm very pleased. Thank you so much. Now you're learning with us. Done. Bye, everyone. Life goes up and it goes down. In the next episode. I know my mom taught me that I figured why we fool around So little And we keep track of time Being so serious Idiot Tyler! Tyler, we need to talk right now You will write the test If the result is good, then you will stay on campus What if not? If not, then We'll have to say goodbye He failed to get his memories back Will this continue? Guys, this will continue until we stop dropping in the rankings. I just don't understand how this could happen. We recently ranked third among all campuses in the city, and today, today we are fourth. Who makes these rankings anyway? Mrs. Cooper, if rankings are based on other indicators, we would definitely win. Yeah? And by what indicators would we be in the first place? Well, for example, in beauty for sure. Mrs. Cooper, don't worry so much. We'll solve everything. We'll come up with something. My classmates and I will help you. Classmates. Now we're just classmates. 
you probably don't understand. Do you know what they did? They created a chat with all campus directors. They write such things about our campus. You can't even imagine. Can you also write something about them in chat? Yeah, write. But what should I write? You write, and I'll tell you what. Oh, that could be dangerous. I know. Our campus will move up from fourth to first because we'll get the hype. Isn't that a bad word? Hype? Is it okay? Oh, it's a great word. Oh, looks like Brittany's up to something. Well, maybe this time something will work out. Brittany, can I help you with the hype? I'm gonna say something, but you want all that I see. You got dynamite. That smell's gonna be the end of me. I bet it tastes like chocolate. Can I have it for free? I'm an explosion, and that smile's gonna be the end of me. That smile, that smile, that smile, that smile's gonna be the end. I wanna say something, but you are all that I see. You got dynamite. That smile's gonna be the end of me. freaking me out. You know, when Mary left, I thought that happiness had come. But no, now things are even worse. Chloe, we've been for a lot. The main thing for us now is to not quarrel and stick together. Yeah, and please tell your boyfriend to stop hitting on me. He was hitting on you? Well, not really, but a bit. Just a little bit. What? You know, he seems to like me. Oh my gosh. Hey, stop, stop, stop. Calm down. Yeah, please. I don't need him. I have Max. And besides, I have more important things to do. I have to figure out how to catch the hype. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Chloe, so don't worry. I'm sure Tyler will remember everything. You just gotta give him a push. I'm so mad at him that I want to not only push him, but... All right, okay, okay, okay. Enough. I have an idea. We'll need to recreate the situation that once happened to him. Maybe then he'll remember. Right. This is an awesome idea. Chloe, I'll help you. Then you unlock Tyler's memories and I'll stay doing the hype. Let's go. Let's go. Do you guys think that the girls will be able to make Tyler remember something? Write in the comments. And I'm going to make a hype. Well, bro, let's do a cool workout, as always. Are you guys really called Twix? Or did they play a joke on me to make a fool of me? Nope, that's really what they call us, but we're already used to it. Thomas is used to it, but I'm not. Oh, Tyler, you decided to play. I hope that ball will hit you in the head and you'll finally remember everything. What am I supposed to remember? I know that I have memory problems, but I already remembered everything, okay? Oh, not really. Alright, let's play. Yeah, Martin, let's play, because I don't want to get into a fight with the captain. What if I come back to basketball? Wait, what? What did you say? Who don't you want to fight? Martin, go away, you're bothering us. Yeah, let's play. With a captain. Oh, girls, don't you know what Brittany came up with? No, we don't. We have more important things to do. Actually, things are going down on campus. This applies to everyone. Leo, when will you realize that our life doesn't stop at school? We have other things to do. Got it? Not really. Listen, nerd. I'm not a nerd. Actually, I'm a head boy. Don't talk to me like that. Listen, nerd. Bye-bye. Wait, what? He can help us? I wonder how? Well, if you act nicely, then maybe I could help you. Mm. Damn, nothing feels right. We need to do something on campus that everyone will be shocked and want to repeat. Martin, do you have any ideas? I was sure you figured it out already. I came up with an idea to catch the hype, but I don't know how exactly to do it. Well, we need something big. 
What if I cover the entire campus in pink fur and rhinestones? I think that'll be very cool and individual. Not that big, Brittany. Um, why are you so upset? Max told Tyler he was the captain of the team. So? Hello, Brittany, that's a lie. Well, you know, Tyler probably doesn't even remember how to hit the hoop. Anyway, I don't plan to ignore this. I have to tell Tyler that he put the lookers together, that he is the captain of the team. Okay, but just please be careful. You know it can be stressful for him. I know. Stop, stop. Guys, I have a really cool idea. But first, subscribe to our channel so that I can tell you this. Subscribed? Really? Do you promise? Good, now I'll turn this idea into a reality. Follow us. Why did you bring me here? Because you're the only one who has the keys to the classroom. Listen, remember how Miss Cooper wanted to kick Tyler out? I remember it, yes. So we'll bring him back to those circumstances and then he'll remember everything. Are you sure this will work? Of course not, but it's worth trying. Okay, is there any help you need from me? Yeah, find Tyler and tell him that he might be expelled and that he needs to write the final test. Yeah, like a couple of months ago. Okay, I'll try and see what I can do. Don't try, gotta do it! Tyler, my friend! Hello! Hey, man. I have to tell you something. Um, well... Tyler, we need to talk right now, but I'm talking to Leo. Leo can wait. It's very important. I'll find you later. Good job, Leo. You helped the girls. <sighs> hey, BD. Oh, hi. Listen, Max, I've come up with something. You'll be shocked. Or should I call you Captain Max? How do you know? Martin told me. He thinks it's bad you're lying about it. To be honest, I really don't care what Martin did or said. But honestly, lying is not cool. Oh, is that you telling me? You're funny. Have I ever lied to you? No. Actually, I wanted to have a serious talk, but I don't feel like it anymore. What? You're mad at me? Look, I'll give him a test and Leah will take Miss Cooper's seat. Tyler will remember everything because of stress. But he shouldn't be stressed. What are you doing here? We just, uh... I'm just helping Chloe with math. Uh-huh. It's a little weird, but okay. It's trouble. Girls, damn it. He won't come. I uh -huh. couldn't call him. Call who? Ah! Mom, damn. You scared me. All but... right, tell me what happened. I don't like lies, you know that. Long story short, Mrs. Cooper, we want Tyler's memory back. We want to bring him back to the memories he already lived before. And then maybe he'll remember everything. That's actually a very good idea. Mom, can you help us? Of course. I think this idea should work. Now, I will write to the campus chat so that Tyler will come to class. We'll come up with something here. Why did you call me so urgently? Did something happen? Yes, it happened. What? Well... Even though you lost your memory, you should know that I'm your best friend. I know it, you already told me. So, as your best friend, I want to tell you, you were the captain of the Luckers team. And Chloe, Chloe's your girlfriend. We're all worried about this right now. Martin, why are you so nervous? Because it's hard. It's hard because you don't remember anything. But I remember everything. Well, then whose locker is this? Nobody's. It's Mary's locker. You don't remember this? A crazy one studied with us? If so, then you just have to believe me and listen to what I say. And I say that you're a cool basketball player. Max wanted to lie to you and tell you he's the captain of the team, not you. Strange. Mrs. Cooper is calling me to class right now. Tyler, can you listen to me? I can, but listen to me. Before I could date Chloe, I could be the greatest basketball player. Let it be. But I'm different now. I have a completely different interest and lifestyle. And a different taste in girls. Rush B. Rush Sector B. They're on A. Run here. Do you look at the map at all? Cover me. Guys. Oh, you're alone? Uh-huh. 
Actually, I figured out how to make our campus famous and get everyone talking about us. I have one idea. Did you confuse Thomas and Max again? Very funny. Why did you come? I figured out what we can do for the campus. Well? We're gonna do a charity sale. Wow, I didn't expect to hear this from you. I don't really know how the sale will help us. How? Easy peasy. We'll do a good deed and glorify the campus. Not a bad idea at all. We'll sell all our unnecessary stuff and donate the money to a charity foundation. Who are you and what did you do with the real Brittany? Yeah. I feel it was Brittany who lost her memory, not Tyler. <laughs> yeah, Mrs. Cooper, did you call me? Oh, girls, you're here too. The girls are leaving. Yes, we're leaving. So do I. So, Tyler, we need to have a serious talk. I'm listening. You lost your memory and don't remember much. So I think it's hard for you to study on our campus. I disagree with you. I'm on the same level with everyone. I checked it. Well, I don't think so. Anyway, let's do the next thing. You'll write the test. If the result is good, then you will stay on campus. What if not? If not, then we'll have to say goodbye. I'm so scared, Mrs. Cooper. I don't know or remember any of you. I don't give a damn about what's on the campus to study on. Give me your test. Take your seat. Here's the test. Ready? May I be free? Yes. Didn't work out? No. <sighs> Whoa, what's that gonna be? My dad invited a lot of journalists to our school. They'll write about our campus. And of course about me. Wow, what a great idea. <laughs> well, I didn't do anything special. I really love kind girls. Tyler, actually you love me. Chloe, what? Tyler, how could you? How could you forget our love? I better go. No, wait, don't go. Chloe, you're not my type at all. Brittany came up with a cool thing. Yeah, we can sell all the old books. Yeah, and I... Uh, I'll sell the old boots. Martin, today we wanted to return Tyler's memory, but it's pointless. Emma, believe me, it's hard for me too. But you need to distract yourself. You need to live on your own life. You're right, there's a sale coming up soon. Sorry, I thought there's no one here. You can stay with us. If you don't mind. By the way, did you hear Brittany's having a charity sale? Can you stop talking about Brittany? Yeah, I feel sorry for her. Really? Brittany, wait! Tyler, hold on. You see, I don't like you. You have Chloe. Which Chloe? I really like you. You're so wrong. Yes, she's here. Brittany, Miss Cooper says the teachers have chatted again. Have you come up with something? Yeah, we'll have a charity event. Also, my dad invited journalists to the school. Everyone will know about our campus. Brittany wants to do a charity event. Uh-huh. Mom said it's a very cool idea. She'll be doing the charity work. When will it be? Tomorrow. Tomorrow? So fast? Well, why wait? I can rap. Okay, I got it. Mom will take care of it, but journalists are on you. You're so kind. You didn't think so before. What if he never remembers me? No, that's impossible. He'll definitely remember. Moreover, we'll help you with this. Yeah, we've got a new idea. Uh-huh. We failed to get his memories back. We'll make Tyler fall in love with you again. We'll try to help you. Here's my notebook. I drew up an action plan. Are you guys really going to help me? Of course. Yeah, let's get Tyler's memory back. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's go! go. Yeah. Guys, thanks a lot for watching. Put likes, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget about the bell. Also, subscribe to our TikTok and Instagram accounts. And be the first to see our next episode. Write in the comments, what did Brittany do to help the campus?
Also, as always, we choose the most liked comment. Today is from Rasat Deliva. She wrote, I just adore you. You're all very cool. We're very pleased. Thank you very much. Actually, you are very cool. Done. Rasat, now you're learning with us. Bye, Bye everyone. everyone. In the next episode, I know my mom taught me that I figured why we fool around so little and we keep track of time being so serious idiots thinking it will matter to keep me company downtown laugh 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 i'll soon be on the cover of the magazine that you will be selling you know it's probably better for you not to spend the night on campus with us tonight 